Yeah, hi guys. Good afternoon, everybody. Hello. Good afternoon, Ravi. Yeah. Hi, good afternoon, Ravi. Yeah. I wish you a very um, happy Ashivratri to everyone. Thank you. Same to you, Ravi. Thank you, same to you, Ravi. Okay, guys. So last time where we are now, just I need to remind it, guys. Okay, I don't know where. Uh, okay, yeah, got it. We completed date API map and object and array. These things we completed last time. What is that? We are working on the date API, right? Come on, guys. Yeah. Let's check the name. Okay, Manjulata Sandeep. These people are there. Okay, good. Good afternoon, sir. Yeah, good afternoon. Yesterday, one week onward, one person is disturbing a lot for the spring uh, boot MBC with GSP. That that uh, person is joined our session. He made me too much irritated, guys. Actually, you know, whenever I'm there in the office, continuously he's calling, even though I told him, don't call me, don't send the message privately. It's uh, disturbing me a lot because whenever I'm working in the office, my uh, WhatsApp is logged in my uh, uh, system itself only I'm logged in. If anyone needed a response and all those things, continuously is disturbing a lot in the office itself only. You don't know it. Even the multiple time I told him, I will, I will, I will help you. Don't worry. Jo Even though I told him, join the morning session also. Let it be. If, we, if you are there, please unmute yourself. If you are there, please unmute yourself. If you are not uh, comfortable in English, you can speak Hindi with me. Don't worry about that. But you can unmute yourself. And if you have, or if you are there in the session, please. I don't. Okay. Now let's start our discussion about that, guys. Okay. Whenever he will come, he will, if he needed really. Uh -huh. After then, if he will di uh, disturb me, then I'll kick him from the group. Sakti, please mute yourself. Okay, guys. So now let's start our discussion. Let's start our discussion now, guys. So today we are going to understand what is that regular expression regular expression let's start our discussion about that regular expression now regular expression uh, Sakti. Uh, sorry sorry uh. please regular expression right guys okay if you are the ui developer or any programming programmer guys without regular expression your day will not complete so please keep in the mind so we need to learn regular expression right so regular expression type regular expression type first we will understand in the regular expression how we are declaring the things how we are validating the inputs and all those things everything we will learn carefully now okay so now let's start our discussion about that first we will understand what is regular expression what is regular expression a uh, regular expression regular regular expression regular expression regular expression is a pattern regular expression is a pattern used 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 to verify verify used to verify the format 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 of input format of what input value input value just just take one example guys okay if we have if we have what is that if we have if we have just assume that this input email input right email input so we need to very validate in this in uh, email address address should be 
dot should be right hyphen symbol also should be to validate this kind of input so we need what regular expression regular expression now so based on that what is that what we are doing now based on that regular expression we are validating our input in the html in the html as well as what we are doing now using the angular now so how we are how we are constructing angular expression how we are constructing angular expression a python a python is built 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 by using built by using using what is that meta character using by meta character and what is that quantifier and quantifiers right quantifiers right now just what is that i'll tell guys i'll tell i'll tell how just let's take input we are taking what is that input button input type input type equal to what is that we are taking text text right text now inside that what we want python we, we will we will match the python 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 right python inside that what we will do it now we will write what is that regular expression to validate this input this input so to validating this input for that we need to construct what is that regular expression so if we want to construct the regular expression then what we need now guys meta characters and a quantifier meta characters and a quantifier people are getting my point whatever i'm explaining now guys don't worry yes, Still, yes, in the theory in the theory part you know, until unless if we not complete theory this based on this theory only what we will do it now we will do the practical guys then more clarity will come don't worry about that right but the thing is in the theory whatever things i'm explaining everyone is catching those word and points yeah now yes. now 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 okay so next what is that next what is that how 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 we are how how we are writing a regular expression which symbols we are using now which symbols we are using now a regular expression a regular expression a regular expression is a combination combination of what is that meta characters meta characters and a quantifier quantifiers enclosed 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 in enclosed in what is that enclosed in which symbols now guys double slash double slash right double slash now so so in so in in type script in type script whenever we are writing we are using what is that any any type any type is used is used to what used to store used to store a regular expression <coughs> regular expression regular expression regular expression now okay so what is the syntax now guys what is the syntax 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 we will just let's take we will take one let keyword we will take regular regular expression regular expression data type will be any and here we will write what here we will write what is that we will not write in the double quote guys because if we write in the double quote then it will be treated as a string then what is that we will use what slash slash symbol and inside that what we will do it now pattern pattern right pattern then it one it this one will treat as a what regular expression then this one is will treat as a what regular expression now regular expression now so 
let's understand let's write some meta character and a let's start our practical on it so everyone is ready for that now guys yes ready yes, yeah yes sir. okay so now let's understand those things now guys if you are the ui developer angular developer your day will not complete uh, mark my word guys with the without regular expression if you are the UI developer or if already anyone is joined our session as experience with the experience in some uh, uh, UI related, that person, if uh, that person is really good experienced in the or really is working in the UI, definitely that person will tell, yeah, Ravi Kant, whatever you are saying, that word is correct. Because without regular expression, without validating our input, we not a single second also will complete if you are the you are ui developer guys so please focus on this area i'm explaining very carefully now so uh, once our once our um type script will complete a uh, once our angular will complete uh, right no one will touch you it's my guarantee guys in this uh, technology and in this area if really carefully if you guys are doing the practical now, now, now let's understand the things now. So what is meta? What is meta character? Character. What is meta character? Meta character and it's a description. Let's understand those things first. It's a description now. It's a description now. First meta character is question mark. First meta character is question mark and wh why we are using and what is the use and how many places we are where we are using now. So what is the meaning of this question mark? Question mark is presenting 0, 0, 0, 0 or 1, 0 or 1 occurrence. Zero are one occurrence. Now, now again, what is that? Another meta character is plus symbol. Another meta character is what? Plus symbol. Plus symbol is presenting what is that? One, one or one or one or more more occurrences. more occurrences right as well as what is that we have a star symbol we have what a star symbol a star symbol is presenting what zero 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 are more occurrences occurrences zero are more occurrences now let's design one what let's based on the be based on these symbols let's design one program and we will see that how these things is working it now how these things is working working now okay so what i'm doing now guys so let's take one index dot html should i take in this one or let's uh, okay let's take in this one in this file only right remove these things now guys remove these things now what is our requirement now guys what is our requirement our requirement is our requirement is what is that so we want right we want we want we want to choose the color we want to choose the color in any particular uh, expression right in any particular expression like what is that this is the this is what is that C O L O R color also right as well as what in the CSS uh, in the HTML CSS I'm talking about the terminology of CSS or uh, it can be except what is that it can be except color color both 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 are both are correct right both are correct both are correct except these two except these two if we are taking any other expression then one will that one will expose ourselves expose at like this is not right um, color this is not right color right like that we will design one application right like that we will design one uh, application then what is that how we will validate these things now how we will validate these things now for that for that we will take just what is that just we will define one let 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 
regular expression regular expression any type we will take what is that any type now in that in that what is that what we will do it now we will take we will take what is that color color we will take color right color or we can take we will take what is that color this is correct but what is that in this color what is that u is extra right u is what extra come on u is extra or not guys come on then what we will do it now yes. we will take u u yes. instead in, in the place of u what we will do it now we will make as a question mark we will make it as a question mark then question mark is what is that what is presenting now just only this word this zero word. Or one. this question mark is presenting what is that zero or one if you are giving this u that is also fine it will accept if you are not giving u that is also fine right that is also fine now based on this one let's design one application now example not application example right now let's take let let take let hmm. and word i'm taking what is that word word uh, Rabbi, you're is... writing in the just file oh good good yes right let's take let 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 take word 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 right word is what is that our word is a string a string in the word what i'm taking now i'm taking color i'm taking what is that simple color color but what is that we want to validate this color with what regular expression we want to validate this color with the regular expression then what we need to do now what we need to do now our requirement is what our requirement yeah. is what this this color also should be correct and this one also will correct right then what we need to do now guys we will take let let regular expression regular expression now make this one as a any and in the any what we need to do now we need to validate this color we need to validate this color 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 right color color now here we will make this one as a question mark we will make this one as a question mark now one more things i need to explain it guys one more things i need to explain it before that because based on that we need to validate so if we want to validate then what is that input value input value input value is what is that is a is a compare compared with what compared with uh, compare with what is that regular regular expression regular expression by using by using by using what is that what is the function now guys match match function by using what is that match function what it's doing now it is a it is a it is a it is a it is a, it is a boolean 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 function boolean function that boolean function that return that return true that return true when value is match when value is match match matching value is matching with what matching with what with a regular expression regular expression regular expression right regular expression then how what is the syntax now guys we will write if condition if condition and that value we will take value we will take and match match function in the match function we will pass regular expression regular expression if this one is returning true then then what is that true block will execute then true block is execute if if true if true now let's do that let's do that now okay so here we will check if condition we will check if condition inside that inside that we will take what is that what we will take it now guys we will take word with word only right with this one only we need to check it now come on we need to compare or we need to 
take the expression. Now we will take here what is that? What we will take it now, guys? We will take match function. Match function. Now in this match function, what we will pass it now? We will pass our regular expression. We will pass our regular expression. Now console dot log. Console dot log. Why? My daddy is, you know, whenever I'm starting the session at the time only is calling, even he know that I'm taking the session. Later I will talk. Just talk to me, it's... it's okay, no issues. I'll talk. He knows that I'm taking the session um, from the 2 p.m. on, but, but uh, <laughs> multiple yeah. times. Yeah, there is just uh, pick the call and if there is no emergency, we'll continue, Ravi. It's okay. There is nothing leave it uh, i'll uh, i'll talk with him after completing our session okay so now now here what we will do it now we will write what is that your your let's take the expression your 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 what is that spelling spelling your spelling dollar symbol dollar symbol word right word word is correct word is correct now okay now fine guys else we will take else we will take what is that console console dot log console dot log Now inside that, let's take invalid, 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 invalid. You can, you can enter only color or color right color or color now whatever invalid color is there you can take as a expression also you can take as a expression also now what is that let's take word let's take word now let's compile and let's run it now it is there in the src now so we make we will make this one as a we need command prompt now cd cd src cls now tsc tsc what is that index index dot ts compile it now compile next what we need to do now guys we need to run it node 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 what is that index 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 dot js now your spelling is correct even though even though what is that if you are making here what you let's take you now you means what you already there right you zero r1 i'm including here what you now let's compile it now run it see your spelling is color is correct right now what we will do it now make this one one letter capital one letter capital here make one letter capital now compile it and run it it will give what your invalid invalid you can enter only color small letter or color like that see what we are getting now guys color invalid you can enter what is that you can enter only color or color right because here we taken what input we taken as a capital letter come on guys mm? yes right so now same like what is that let's take this example let's take this example now let's understand more meta character let's understand more meta character now instead of okay now in this example only what i'm going to do now i just explain one right let's take plus symbol also one or more occurrences one or more occurrences so here what i'm taking now let's take plus symbol here let's take plus symbol 
Now here, what I'm taking now, C color. Let's take color now. One or more, right? One or more. Now here, what I'm doing now, I'm taking color, color. Now, if we compile it, what we are getting now color uh, color invalid you can enter only color or color why because you isn't there you must be one or what is that you must be one or more one or more, one or more. but here what you isn't there you isn't there right you isn't there if you make here you if you make here you then if you compile then what is that see this Now your spelling is correct, right? Or if you increase again, you, you are you multiple times, then what is that? Your spelling is correct, right? Your spelling is correct because one or more than one, you can be acceptable. But if you are not giving any if you are not giving any u, then it will not accept, right? Means that one is the plus symbol meaning is what that one. A star means what is a zero or more occurrences. Zero or more occurrences means what? Here, if you are giving, there is no issue in that. Now, let's give a star. Let's give a star. Means what? This is fine. Zero or more. Now, if you, if you compile, compile, if you compile, Now compile it. What is that? Your spelling is correct, right? Your spelling is correct. Means zero. U isn't there in our input value, right? Our in input value. If you are giving you, if you are giving you, then then again compile it. Now your spelling is correct. Again, if you are giving what is that you? That one also acceptable because zero or n number it will accept now see your spelling is correct come on it's working as expected or not how i explain guys come on yes it's sir. working right now yes now now let's understand another meta character also right another meta character also but before that let's take this one as an example here this one as an example now now let's understand another meta character also right another meta character also right what is that if we are taking that slash now what it will represent now guys what it will represent to to define to define to define any any individual any individual entity entity don't worry we will see these things as a practical now guys now w symbol right w w character what it's presenting now it is it is it is an entity uh, it is an uh, entity entity to to allow allow to allow upper case upper to allow to what upper case upper case upper case and uh, lower case lower case alphabet alpha bit alphabet what is that with numeric with what numeric value numeric value numeric value numeric value r r numeric and underscore 
under score right under score like how like how now it will be the like a to z a to z r a to z small r 0 to 9 r 0 to 9 0 to 9 these things it will allow which, which one will allow w w character w character now okay so if you want to allow only decimal number if you want to allow only decimal number then for that is small d is small d what is doing now uh, Ravi. yeah uh, 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 number o and underscore is it underscore or hyphen sorry this one is hyphen only but don't worry uh, still in the practical i will show you <laughs> in the practical just explanation okay. i'm giving about that just still explanation is going on sakti don't worry about that we will see these things as a practical i'll show that see this is the underscore this is the upper and this is the lower case right yeah, yeah, yeah. it's accepted yeah, yeah sure now now okay don't worry about anything guys it's not meaning that here theory is going on we will not implement in the practical we will do the practical and we will understand those things and in which scenario we will implement those things also we will understand guys okay because here we are not just a teacher we are already working in the real world so we know that what is use which usage is there in which places and which situation these things we are using now right come on so it's a very very what is that with our right we are already working employee as well as we are improving our skills as well as what we are doing now even though if you guys are like something if you are learning with me so it's not meaning that just i'm not a working employee even though i'm in the good position also right in the company wherever i'm there in the good position itself only because of my sm knowledge whatever a small knowledge is there i think better than in my colleague so that is the reason i'm good in that i'm not saying better than, than you guys okay but in wherever i'm there in that place little bit good now now let's understand those things now so only this one will allow what is that only only number number right number that is what zero to nine zero to nine if we are taking what is the decimal number it will accept what is that zero to nine nine only number only number allowed right number allowed only number allowed right now open open now slash and in cap is nothing but exclamatory mark right where it is now this one this one what it's presenting now it's a presenting it's a presenting what is that start 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 with start with now dollar symbol dollar symbol is presenting what end with end with now end with end with now okay if we are taking like what is that a to z a to z a to z then what is that only only what only a to z only only what is that upper upper because we taken what is that upper later na? so it will it will present what is that only only upper upper case upper case allowed allowed only upper case allowed now if we are taking what is that a to z if we are taking what a to z if we are taking a to z then means what only only lower lower case lower case allowed allowed right only lower case allowed only lower case allowed now okay so next what is that next what is the some more meta character is there right what is that like if we are taking the combination of what combination of a small letter capital letter as well as number then what is that what is the meta character now guys a to z a to z a to z and 0 to 9 0 to 9 0 to 9 it will it will allow what is that alpha 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 number or numeric 
numeric allowed allowed right allowed now okay if we are taking like what is that a comma let's take d comma s if we are taking what is that if we are taking what if we are taking like that then what is that only only special specified 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 cars cars allowed allowed right only specify cars allowed allowed means what is that only a d s these things